What's going on YouTube and today I'll be doing a Q&A! You guys asked me some questions, so now I'm gonna answer them for you. Corvus Bulky asked me, what is my view on the 18H Plus for Black Ops 3 events? Honestly man, this 18 years old thing has to go! I feel bad for the people out there. I feel bad for the youngins. It sucks, man. When I was younger and I couldn't attend COD Champs, when I was like 17, I couldn't attend the first COD Champs, and I wanted to blow my brains out. I'm missing out on the biggest opportunity ever, and a lot of you guys are gonna feel that way, especially the people with the talent. Huke, TJ, Huke is disgusting. He's gonna say, I consider him a top five player, even if he hasn't placed like, uh, he plays second and third like a go. But this kid, I definitely think he's a top five player this kid is disgusting he's really really good really talented and he probably won't even be able to play next year it just sucks man it sucks that the league has to be 18 plus I mean I understand you know a lot of you guys ask me this question like how do you feel and I just think it sucks man when I was younger and I wanted to participate in caught champs and I couldn't I missed out on the first year because I was 17 and it hurt me man like I miss I felt like I was missing on a bigger opportunity I felt like I feel like a lot of these younger players are gonna feel the same way you know, they're going to miss out probably a whole year of COD. Uh, maybe next year they'll change it or they'll be 17 plus with a, a parent consent form or something like that, man. But it just sucks. You know, uh, Hugh, all these players are probably just going to play tournaments. You know, I don't think they're going to completely go away from the scene. You know, there's still money to, to win in tournaments, online tournaments. The only stuff sucking thing, you might not be on a good team, on a no team, just because it's 18 plus. J.S. Mythic asked me, what's my favorite part of Sharp's face? Honestly, man, I'm gonna have to go with this man's nose. His nose is so, so sharp, so precise. It's like, he has a perfect nose. Have you seen this man's nose? Look at it. Dude, Sharp has such a, like, thin and nice, like, clean nose. Like, that has to be his best feature. But if I were to say anything after that, his whole face is that beautiful. The guy's a 10 out of 10. What? Basic asked me how hard was it for me to get seen or noticed when I was on the come up. Honestly, man, it was so, 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 so hard. I remember joining like a semi-known team and after I left that team or we broke up, whatever the case was, I kept joining like sorry teams, you know, and I had to, I had to stay there because I didn't have a home. I had to stay on these sorry teams, teams that I knew I was way better than every single player, way better. But I was forced to do that because I wasn't that known. You know, it's not like, oh shoot, that's apathy and like a known team picks me up. No, it's like, like you're, you're a, you're a semi-good amateur, you know, no one's really going to pick you up. So I had to kind of work my way up a little bit again. I was playing on these weird teams until I got, got lucky with an opportunity. So it's really hard though, you know, I had to put money, had to invest money to play all these online tournaments, all these things. And it just, it's hard work, it's dedication, but if you can show everyone that you're good and you can show them that you have what it takes, you're gonna get known sooner or later. You know, playing online tournaments is a great way. Zarin Call, that's my whole is your funniest pro you've ever tamed with. I'm probably gonna have to go with Sharp, dude. Sharp is hilarious. Like, he's a funny dude. The stuff he says, like the comments are just funny as fuck. And then he has his moments where like we're playing mid-game and he just says stupid shit or shit that's funny. Like he's a he's an all-around like Johnny a jolly funny guy. Like, I love teaming with him because he's good vibes and he's always like making me laugh over stupid stuff. That like, would be like the stupidest thing ever. And he would just comment on it and I'll just start laughing because he's an idiot. He's a clown! Sometimes I could be a clown too a little bit, but yeah, definitely sharp. Canadian 3G6 asked me, what do I do with Caitlyn Jenner every week for a billion dollars? What I? Who wouldn't? I don't get you guys! Am I missing something? That's a billion dollars! I just don't understand. Honestly, guys, I wouldn't. I even if I was single, I wouldn't. I, I would have to be really, really desperate for money, and it's nah, nah, nah. Fears melt, which is my son. Asked me, "Am I your son, Dad? Son? Of course, you're my son. What? Why are you asking me? Am I your son, Dad? If you're already saying I'm your..." You're my, I'm your dad, son. Yes, you're, you're my son. You're, 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 you're. Iran asked me, who on the TK roster is most likely to end up in jail? That's kind of hard, because when you think about it, we're all maniacs. You have Sharp, jolly funny guy, but could have a bad temper. You never know what he might do. Neslo, the killer. All right, he's not the killer. Don't put the wrong image in there. You know, people think of him that way. But he could be a little psychopathic sometimes. Then you have Theory. Fucking Theory. He's such a chill dude. 
But sometimes, it's the chill dude that is the criminal. So I'm just gonna be a stereotype and go with Neslo. Neslo's gonna end up shooting a school and go to jail. Or hopefully, no, 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 hopefully nothing that bad. That's, that's, that's awful. He's gonna rob a bank. Everyone's gonna live in there. That's what he's gonna do. Jail. Based, Gabby asked me why to stop uploading to my second channel. Well, first off, when I made that second channel, you know, I had high expectations. You know, I was gonna grind, put in the time on that second channel, and I realized it's not really the time now. I'm still growing my first channel. I have 63k subs, which is amazing. I love it. But obviously, like, until I hit maybe 150, 200,000, until then, I'm not gonna work on that second channel. Just because, you know, I have to focus on my main channel. I have to put the most time I can to make my main channel grow. Making a second channel grow very slowly, it's not really worth the time and effort rather than putting all my time and effort into this channel. So that's what I'm doing right now, guys. Cam asked me, screw, Mary, kill, Nezlo, sharp, in theory. All right, I'm gonna have to kill Nezlo. I can't, I can't risk it. You never know, one day he just may pull out a knife on me, <laughs> laugh at me, and fucking stab me. I'm not risking any of that stuff. I'm sorry, Nezlo. You're going out first. I have to live. All right, I'll marry Sharp, dude. I have to go with Sharp. I, I think Sharp's a, he's a beautiful man, but I'm gonna have to marry him. He's he's a he's a he's a husband type. I, I'm a, I'm a husband him up. And get and then I, I guess I'll just screw theory. theory. I, I never had any of those images or ideas in my head, and I don't I'm not gonna plan to right now. But we'll just leave it there. I'm gonna screw theory. Exhibition asked me, what do you see Temp, Puke, and TJ doing for Black Ops 3? This is kind of what I talked about earlier, but I just want to go over it one more time. First of all, I see them playing online tournaments. These kids are fucking good. They're good. I doubt they're going to quit. They might like not play as much as they do now, unless somehow there's like another league. They wow, it's not about that, you know? I think someone who is smart enough and has money could make a league. A league for younger kids. What? That's that's game that's a game changing league for Black Ops 3. So that might happen, but if that doesn't happen, I just see them playing Black Ops 3 tournaments. There's Black Ops 3, it's gonna blow up, you know. It's supposed to happen. It's gonna be a really good game. There's probably gonna be tournaments, tons, tons, tons of tournaments on UMG, GB. You know, these three might team together with one more kid, and this is gonna grind tournaments. And honestly, you know, considering how good they are at this game, uh, they might not be as good at Black Ops 3 because it's a little more traditional but I think they'll still be pretty good and you know they can win some money on this game Dean Cod asked guys guys Dean Cod asked me will you ever follow me he follows me and you just my friend have been have been followed Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps a lot. Subscribe to my channel, man. This has been Apathy TK, and I'm motherfucking...